What DeepSeek fundamentally did was to make training more efficient. It doesn't have as big an impact on as inference. Once inference becomes more efficient, um, then it's going to become much less expensive to you know to ask to ask you know, to ask questions to apply it. Uh, with DeepSeek, it is likely going to be if you, if you think about the companies, the corporations that are training their own models now. It, it's a handful of the biggest Fortune 100 global companies that have both the means and the need to do that. Maybe that'll become available to the Fortune or practical for the Fortune 500. So more companies will be in a position, but paradoxically, as something gets cheaper, more and more, you, know, you actually get more and more consumption of it. As inference becomes more cost effective, I think more and more companies are going to be able to do more sophisticated things. Their companies now are running into the same challenge that we ran into in the early days of cloud, which is, oh my God, that cloud bill is yeah. pretty big. And inference remains expensive. And so I think we're going to see have to see that same innovation apply, innovation applied on the inference side to drive much more significant adoption. Because at some point, it's, if everybody in the company starts using it all the time with the current generation of models, it's going to be prohibitively expensive. Yeah. Well